does that even mean, Bowers Game Corner? Ahoy there, YouTube! I'm back again today for another unboxing video, and today I'm very excited to be unboxing Catapult Castle from Imperial Publishing. This is for one to four players, age is seven plus, take about 30 minutes to play. First thing you'll notice is this is a different box. This is a unique box. This is more like a, almost like a toy-esque box. If you have any uh, family or children's games that have like large pieces of plastic, a lot of times they'll go with boxes like this. That being said, it feels perfectly sturdy and durable. Like, you hear that sound, which is good. And I imagine it's a little bit thicker because, yep, inside, whoa, holy guacamole. <laughs> this bag is not a toy. I'll be the judge of that. Oh, that is so a toy. Okay, but back to the game. Wow, look at these. Oh, there's one. <laughs> Those are thick, sturdy interesting very interesting construction okay so you're gonna get a whole bunch of these which are obviously the castles but the star of the show i imagine the catapult so let's ooh, what's inside ooh, don't use your teeth all right what do we got catapult test here's the big thing is it okay let's give it a whirl little cannonballs very cool i gotta say these cannonballs have some heft to them uh i'm wondering if maybe they're Metallic in the center or something? They're weird. They're very weird. They uh, they almost look like clay. They don't have the texture you would expect or the taste. All right, let's check it out. This is the test. This is the test. Let's go for the distance test. All right, so let's see. Let's see how far we get this. All right, so where is it? We, we're right here at the subscriber sign. All right, here we go. Ready, set, boom. Decent. Decent, very decent. I'll go grab that real quick in a second. I won't forget it where it is, hopefully. All right, so what else we got in here? What else we got in here? There's, uh, there's, there's uh, rules. Oh, there we go, more stuff. <laughs> All right, so interesting. It's it's given me almost like a, uh, a coconut-esque vibe, but different, definitely different as I'm going to be catapulting. And actually, uh, I played a couple, I played another Catapults game as well for Mayday Games, one that I enjoyed uh, a way back when. It wasn't the easiest game to play, but cool. So we got stickers. Oh, oh, I see. So stickers to go on the doors of the castles. You want to put it on those? Yeah, I doubt you really need to, but still. 32 cards. There's cards? Where did the cards go? Did I miss the cards? How did I miss the cards? Where are the cards? I don't see cards. This is a DEFCON 5 emergency. All right, no cards. Box is gone. Don't need box. These, got them. 32 cards. Where, where did the cards go? Did I lose cards? Oh my gosh. Are they here? Are they there? They're not here. They're not there. Where are the cards? There's gotta be cards. Did I not get cards? Oh no. I need to tell Seth. <laughs> well, any, oh, never mind. Cards. I'm just blind. So, uh, square cards. Ooh, I like the artwork on those cards. Very, very cool. So, what do we got going on here? And this is hopefully going to... Okay, so it looks like you're going to have different colors. I'm assuming those are going to be your different player colors. And what do these say? Reinforced roof. Place this card on a tower. The next shot that goes in this tower remove this, uh, removes this roof instead of the tower. Oh, you can protect it. Okay. Reinforced roof. Magic toss. Toss your shots with your hand this turn. Oh, cool. Your shots that go in towers this turn take the whole stack. Okay. I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued. This looks very interesting. This is Catapult Castle from Imperial Publishing. If it looks like it might be a cup of tea, be sure to check this one out. Also, solo version of the game. Awesome. I'm going to try that one out a little bit later. But if you enjoy what I'm doing or if you want to see more about Catapult Castles, be sure to click on that subscribe button down below as I'm trying to reach 9,000 subscribers. Celebrate my nine-year anniversary of making YouTube content. And in the comments below, let me know. If you could have a castle... Anywhere in the world, where would you want your castle to be? I would want my castle to be smack dab in the middle of a really big city. Like, I would love to have it just in the middle of a big city next to a stadium, potentially, where, like, it would be a castle, so it'd be so big that it would feel like I'm, I'm private, you know? Because you'd have, like, huge gates around you, and you'd have a, I assume you'd have a moat. I mean, this is my castle in the middle of Denver. Uh, so, yeah, I'd have a moat. Uh, but yeah, let me know. Where are you going to have your castle? You want it on top of a mountain? You want it under the ocean? No, because then you'll drown and die. But then again, if I have a moat, why can't you have special breathing stuff? I would assume that's legit. I'm going to allow it in the comments down below just this one time, though. Let me know in the comments. And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube. Bye-bye.